So, uh, I got into AWS Community Builders last week, um, which is awesome. Um, that was big news for me. I have been trying to get more hooked up with Community Builders as a community for like a little while, and um, it felt really nice to get recognized, and so far it's been like a really, really cool program. Really, really excited to be there. Um, so what is Community Builders? Um, AWS has had a, you know, a number of programs to kind of reach out and develop people out there kind of writing and otherwise producing content that's um, useful to them. I mean, I don't know, it sounds a little Machiavellian, but you know, content that assists people with uh, getting to know AWS services, maybe paints them in a good light, but, but sort of more significantly gets that information out there. The primary problem at AWS is definitely not that people don't love AWS tools, but just that, you know, they're complex and, and big tools and they require some knowledge to, to use them. So trying to recognize that there is a space for um, recognizing people who work just in the community sharing that knowledge. Um, you know, there's always going to be, frankly, AWS is such a big business that it's, it's big business to teach people about AWS, to talk about AWS. And while, you know, there's really cool orgs like A Cloud Guru that, you know, have a nice little private business teaching people about AWS stuff, um, the fact is that there's also just people out there every day writing tutorials and guides and, and sharing their knowledge. And there really wasn't a great home for that within AWS previously. So Community Builders is a really, really nice uh, program and hopefully we'll see kind of other cloud providers and other large orgs kind of a aping that a little bit as as time is forward. Um, I wanted to show on dev there's this really nice collection. I'm going to move my video down to the corner. Um, there's this really nice collection on dev of nope, not that. That's where it's supposed to be. I want to move me. Hello, and I want to be bigger. Yeah, something to match my ego. There we go. So um, there's a really fantastic collection of information already up on DevTO uh, from the Community Builders, which is pretty rad considering that Community Builders has been running for like a relatively short period of time. I guess there's some beta people in here because we, we only got access like late October. And so some people were in in the beta program. Um, so they posted some stuff. There's some... Uh, um, there was this fantastic thing I saw, like, just a second ago. Let me find it again. Yeah. Our pre pet post this really amazing introduction to AWS Lambda permissions. And, oh, it's really, really nice. It, it's a really, really good exposition of this stuff um, that that has, like... Ugh, I, I, I want to steal this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to, like... I'm going to have to contact the guy and, and ask, ask to use it because it's so good. Um... But yeah, it's a really, really neat community of people. Um, I think most members are participating for a couple reasons. One, it is kind of this tiny badge to say, hey, AWS kind of recognized that I know what I'm talking about. Um, and then also, it, to, to another extent, it shows, um, it gives us a chance to get a little bit of inside information, which is very, very nice for most of us, that it's a chance to, to see like, um, stuff a little bit before it gets released and hopefully be prepped. I, I, I think the concept there is really like it helps us prep content and stuff to say about new releases a little bit before they actually come out for everybody, which means that kind of at launch there can be more information. And of course the other part of it is right, we get all this information because they can make sure that we're that we, you know, signed an NDA and stuff and aren't going to like blab about it two weeks before the release and mess up their their business plans. Um, AWS Community Builders is a really exciting community to be part of, and what I'm going to be doing kind of as a result of that, let me switch back to my giant face, giant face, hello, um, what I'm going to be doing as part of that is I'm going to have a few more Twitch streams so a little more focused on AWS Cloud stuff. Um, I'm hoping to do a little bit of work with a couple of bootcamp grads, and I'm also going to be producing some stuff for this channel that's a little bit more focused on, like, 
how kind of beginner developers can develop their AWS know-how um, because we are seeing that more and more that we're seeing people ask for kind of AWS experience by name. And obviously, like most of the stuff you do in AWS, or most of the stuff you launch, build, and, and deploy in AWS, it's not really about being you know an AWS professional, right? You're still going to be a web developer, a front end developer. You're going to be a DB administrator, all those things. You know, you're not. It's not like um, it's not like Kubernetes or something where you know really to do Kubernetes in your org, you're going to need people who are like their full time Kubernetes people. It's more like you're just going to like like maybe GitHub or something. It's right it's something that. Um, more and more people, it's like you're expected to understand it along with your like key dev responsibilities. Okay, so I don't need to get into all that. That'll be a separate video. But yeah, I just wanted to make this thing to kind of celebrate and uh, celebrate the community. Um, so yeah, if you're watching this, community builders, thanks so much for having me and uh, hoping to build some big stuff in the near future.